So yesterday, uh, one of the students, uh, one of the students who, who send uh, lunch every week, uh, he, he told me that uh, this week, he, uh, he has something on, he can't make it, we have to make it next week. Uh, then I I saw the I, I saw the first part of the message and I thought okay no problem I can clear the food in my fridge. <laughs> then I read carefully, I read the the rest of the message. Then I realized oh he's going for a medical checkup also. So I replied him. Then after I asked, uh like everything okay? Mm. So <laughs> Then he told me. Then he told me that uh, when he went for his uh, weekly cycling, he felt a bit of a chest discomfort. Yeah, a bit of chest pain. So he's going down. Uh, so he went to, I think he went to see a doctor and the doctor arranged for him to go to do a scan. Yeah, because he's about, he's about nine years older than me. Yeah, uh, eight, nine years around there. Yeah, so um uh preventive scan preventive scan uh, to just check mm. so take a deep breath everybody take a deep breath breathe out okay i'm still alive <laughs> yeah if you have anything happen you feel quite upset take a deep breath and breathe out. Okay, I'm still alive. <laughs> uh, okay, bye, Venice. Oh, you catch up later. Say goodbye to Venice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> na, na, chi, chi na li, yao zo, yao, 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 yao xin li kai, zimo dole gani, bye. <laughs> Yeah. Sometimes we uh, we get quite caught up with uh, things in our life, huh? then it affects us a lot. Yeah, it affects us a lot. Uh, many years back when I was in the US, no, not in the US, uh, when I was in Italy, uh, this, that, that same family. So he, the, the father, the family is very cute. I've got to know the grandson first. Then the grandson invited me over to conduct a retreat. Then I got to know the whole family, literally the whole family. <laughs> yeah. The grandfather, the father, the mother, the uncle, the auntie, his best friend, the whole, the whole family. Yeah. Uh, I, I think it is probably called the Italian hospitality. <laughs> When they accept you as a, as a, in a way, a friend or a, a someone they know, they, you, you must know their whole family. <laughs> Thank you. So the father, then, uh, so, so I was there for about 10, 10 days, I think. I went there twice. So the, like, um, for the most part, I spent time with the grandson and the grandfather. But on certain days, the uncle requests to see me, to talk to me. On some days, uh, the father requests to talk to me. So the father, the father runs this uh, something like a, I think travel, travel business. Yeah, and then um, the then the father one day asked me like, how to how to deal with stress. Yeah. How to deal with stress. So I told him, I said, um, I mean, of course, there's no magic bullet. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I told him, like, whenever you are feeling stress, you can try this. Look at your hands. Yeah. Your hands are still around. Um, look at your feet. Your feet are still around, are still around. Then go through the whole body, your body is still around. Yeah. 
whatever has happened in the past has happened, but you know, your hands, arm, hands and legs are still around. They're still alive. Hmm. Uh, sometimes we forget. Uh, sometimes we forget. We get so caught up with whatever is happening. We, uh, we, we, our emotions get so like as though that's the end of the world. <laughs> uh, yeah. And a lot of stress, a lot of unhappiness. Uh, but that is just a start. Because when we feel so affected, then we may feel compelled to go and do something. Yeah. And it's the something that we do that is worse, <laughs> oftentimes. Yeah. Whatever is happening is one thing. Yeah. It's the, the thing, it's our reaction itself that it actually creates more problems, oftentimes. Yeah. Uh, so, go to. You know, throughout the day, don't wait until something happens, then you want to say, Oh, super, 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 take a deep breath. <laughs> no, yeah. When nothing is happening, you must do the exercise. Yeah. Get accustomed to it, familiarize yourself with this awareness. Yeah. That, okay, I'm, I'm alive. Yeah. And most importantly, like at this point in time, Literally, uh, at this point in time, regardless of whatever ups and downs you have gone through, remember it's the ups and downs that you have gone through. It's not just the down. We tend to, to, to focus on the down, that oh, the down has passed already, so, but we are still okay. Important to also consider the up also. Yeah? That no matter in the past, <laughs> how, no matter how glorious it is, now, at this point in time, yeah, so maybe you got some award, yeah, or maybe last year you got, just got promoted to VP. When you wake up, do you wake up as a VP? When you wake up in the morning, do you wake up, uh, VP waking up. <laughs> uh, maybe you become a CEO, CEO of the company. You wake up, the CEO. <laughs> you. Or maybe maybe you got retrenched. Then when you wake up, do you retrench? Do you wake up retrenched person waking up? <laughs> huh? No, right. Or better still, better still. The best way to, to be equanimous to all this up and down is go to you go to the toilet. Go to the toilet to to, to shit. Yeah. No matter how high, how low you were or are, when you shit, it's the same. <laughs> when you pang sai pang, you same, same. Yeah, people always say, ah, when you die, ah, your two legs straighten, same. But by then, too late. By the time you realize it's too late. When you, every day when you shit and, and pee, same. <laughs> Not much difference. Of course, except if you are, seriously ill, then it's a bit different, right? When you're seriously ill, then maybe you have to pee and shit differently. Yeah, which I know of some students who actually go through that, yeah. yeah but other than that, okay, it's okay. Yeah. And the, the breath, the breath is most direct now. No matter what happened, how high, how low, when you breathe in, doesn't mean that you got an award, then now you breathe in through the ear, right? <laughs> huh? But you breathe, breathe in through your hair. Yeah. So, it's okay. Yeah. Then, maybe it can help you. But remember, you must do, the, do this exercise when nothing is happening. Don't wait until something happens, then you want to do the exercise. Okay? Anybody have anything to say? If not, have a normal Tuesday ahead. <laughs>